welcome to Guadalmina, one of the most prestigious neighborhoods in Marbella. And look, no wonder why. Golf, sand, sea, sun. Guys, I'm so excited to show you around. I'm gonna get on that bike there for you today. I'm not getting in a Ferrari, I'm not getting in a Lamborghini. I'm gonna take you around on an old fashioned Engel and Volker's bicycle. What makes Guadalmina so spectacular and so different? Well, it's separated by two parts, Guadalmina Alta and Guadalmina Baja. And right in the center is the magnificent commercial center, which I'm gonna show you a little bit later. So now you know that we have two 18-hole golf courses, but I'm gonna let you in on a little secret that you didn't know. I'm standing on a Lynx course. What does that mean? A Lynx course represents 1% of the world's population of golf courses. And in Marbella, it's the only one. So, let me tell you a little bit more of what is a Lynx course. Well, number one is that it clearly links right down to the sea, which is very unique in itself and very, very special. Number two, it's very, I'm gonna use the word curvaceous, I'm probably using the wrong word, but hey, I Googled it and I, <laughs> this is what I came up with. Um, and it's got to have the dunes. And number three, and the last thing is, it's got a lot of bunkers. So it's a really, really different course and a special course to play on. Now I'm not a golfer, so do bear with me, but I know you golfers out there know what I'm talking about. So let's go now and have a little look around the wonderful, the spectacular, the amazing Guadalmina. On the southernmost part of Guadalmina, behind me is the Guadalmina Hotel, the classic Guadalmina Hotel, with rooms looking right over the, the Lynx Golf Course, to the sea, to the sand, and right on the beach. So this area is well known for the English, Irish, German, French, Italian, all nationalities across the world, both living here and visiting this stunning hotel. Guadalmina is a very vibrant area and well known for some of the best beach clubs, such as the Donatella, the Macau, and the Seoul Beach Club. Let's keep going. So it's hot in Spain, and I need a break. And we're gonna show you one of the beach bars local to Guadalmina Baja. And I'm super excited to show you, because Macau Beach, it's amazing. Michelle, how are Justin, you? How are you? Nice to see you. Very good to see you. Thank you so much for having us. Happy to have you here on Macau Beach. So uh, let's say, grab a cocktail and let's go to the beach. Sure. Come on then. This is one of my favorite places, Michelle. Honestly, I've come here so many times. Being local, a fantastic place to come. So tell me just very quickly, where are you from and when did this all begin, this Macau Beach? Well, uh, Justin, we are originally from Belgium okay. and we took over the place uh, 10 years ago. We were very in love from the first moment uh, yeah. because, like you see, you have a nice view yeah. to Gibraltar. We are very lucky with our clients. We're having international clients. So, yeah. as you know, Marbella, we're having two seasons in a year. Yes. We're having the guys who come for the beach, and then in the winter we have the, the golfers. So what type of food do you guys specialize? We have uh, a French cuisine. A part of this, we're working a lot of baby squid, carbonero, with a lot of local products from here. We mix with our French sauces, so it's a, it's a nice combination. Thank you so much for inviting us down here. Um, a really, really important part of the Guadalmina area, of course, is Macau Beach. So a quick cheers and let's taste one of these amazing cocktails. This is something I gotta say, the cocktails are to die for. Cheers. So I'm standing here in Pueblo de Guadalmina. Property prices starting from around 450, and I want to take a quick sneak peek in the Pueblo because it's something quite special. And only about three minutes walk to the beach, right around the corner from the hotel. Come on, let's go and have a quick look. So can you imagine we're in Guadalmina Baja, right by the Link Course, and here is this charming Andalusian style, kind of like a village. 
but it's next to the hotel, as I said, and right by down by the beach, which is pretty cool. on a bicycle. Well that's because Guadalmina Baja is more or less flat the whole way down. So you can walk, you can ride, you don't need a Ferrari or a Lamborghini in Guadalmina. You can even go by bike. Now this is an example of what Guadalmina is all about. Villa Travertino. My gosh what a house this is. Over 2,000 square meters of build with a plot of almost 4,900 square meters and about two, three minutes down by bike to the beach. This house is an Andalusian dream. And I want you to have a look down at the link there and you'll see some more about it. Let's keep going. I'm having a great day and I'm loving it. Let's go. So here we are driving past Villa Amaria. And uh, Villa Maria is around 700 square meters built with about, well, it's over 2,000 square meters of plot. An absolute stunning, classic villa. One of my per personal favorites. Well, I've got a lot of them. Okay, so we're gonna go up to the chapel and, uh, and then we're off to the commercial center. So let's go, woohoo! <laughs> All right, so we're at the we're at the chapel at the top of Guadalmina Baja area. So we've just finished now our kind of tour around the Guadalmina Baja area. And I'm sure you'll all agree it was absolutely beautiful. Now next, we're gonna go off to the Guadalmina Commercial Center. Before we do, I just wanna give you a little bit more idea about this area so that we don't leave here with any information left behind. So what's important to know here is plot sizes for villas here are starting around 2,000 square meters and they go all the way up to 6,000 square meters and all the gardens in the areas are just absolutely lush and beautiful and tropical. Prices can start from as low as two, two million and a half, but we are talking about refurbs here. So maybe three million to eight, you're gonna get something pretty cool. And then we can go all the way up to 12 million for mega, mega mansions. I'm sure you'll all agree that Guadalmina Baja is something quite spectacular and something very, very different from Marbella. I hope you enjoyed our little run around on my bicycle and I think from, uh, from the commercial center on we may be going by car. Thank you so much. We'll see you at the commercial center. So now we arrive at my favorite office, the Engel and Volker's office. Come on inside. So now we're in the most important shop in the Guadalmina Commercial Center, and that's the Engel and Volker shop. So just give me a second, thank you. So what I wanna do now is I wanna take you through what makes Engel and Volker so special and so different. So just give me a second again. There we go. Thank you. Right, so I'm gonna take you through the steps of what we're all about and the magic of Engel and Volker's. Come follow me into the meeting room and we'll have a little meeting. So what I wanna do is I wanna try and help you understand what makes Engel and Volker so special and so individual. And in fact, what I want to do even more so is what makes you so individual and so special to us and how we treat that. So, this is a map of the Marbella West area, which is my office is the Marbella West office and I focus purely on Marbella West when it comes to property listing and of course our customers. So this is the Marbella West and here you've got Sonia for example. Over here you've got Levy, over here you've got Mads, over here. So each individual area that we've got separated here has an individual broker's 
focused in that particular area. They're a specialist. If you want to look at it like this in the simplest form, there's a micro office in every single area. Rather than being this huge company with 900 offices and you're just one single customer, to us, you're one very, very, very important customer to Sonia. And you're one very, very important customer to Amanda. And that's how we kind of focus and that's how we know the areas, I believe, better than any other agency here. So, welcome to one of my favorite spots, Valeria Local Gourmet Delicatessen. And I want you to come inside and have a little look around and let me show you some of the beautiful products that they have to offer here in Guadalmina. Well, here we are. Check out these tomatoes. What a salad it will make. Now, what I want to do is I want to introduce you to Valeria. And Valeria is the brain behind this incredible delicatessen. So Valeria, I'm not going to speak in Spanish. You're going to speak in Spanish and tell me a little bit about this wonderful delicatessen. ¿Qué tal, Justin? Muy bien, thank you. <laughs> oh no, I wasn't supposed to speak in Spanish. <laughs> Doesn't matter. So tell us. Pues, antes que todo, bienvenidos a Valeria Gourmet. Pues aquí es una tienda que tenemos mucha variedad de producto internacional. Eh, trabajamos sobre todo la gama de chacoterías, que son del mundo. Tenemos vinoteca, de, luego también aceites de olivas, conservas, caviar. En fin, todo aquello bueno y rico que nos hace feliz al estómago y, y al corazón. All right, let's have a look around at this beautiful gourmet delicatessen. Um, I want to try a little bit of one of the Valeria's really special jamón ibérico. It's quite small, but that's all right. Mm, yeah, well, mm, unbelievable. Amazing. Honestly, there's nothing quite like it. Amazing, and just all of this beautiful stuff. I want you to have a look around the shop and just to see what a wonderful delicatessen this is. So welcome to Guadalmina Commercial Center. Gracias. <laughs> Cheers. So guys, I'm going to take you into something really different now. I'm going to take you into Soho Market. Who's that there? Cute. Come on. So welcome to Soho Market and I want to introduce you to Maeva. Maeva is going to tell us a little bit about what Soho Market and what makes this place really, really cool. Maybe. <laughs> so, market, this is a new concept with different kind of shop, different kind of food, food truck, Japanese food, sushi, and tapas and Spanish uh, food also. Uh, we have mu live music on Friday and Saturday night and a lot of champagne. <laughs> and also a lot of uh, different kind of shops, so different fashion brands. So next stop, we're going to stop at the butchers. And oh my God, probably the best looking butcher in town. And that's coming from a guy. So wait till you see this and wait till you see the meats in this place. This is a butcher that you won't forget. So welcome to Guadalmina Butchers. So I can't wait to show you. Wait till you have a look at this. Okay, so we're here now at Ruben's Butchers, and uh, this is Ruben. Hi. Okay, Ruben, tell me, actually, before Ruben tells me anything about, I want you to come over here, Ruben. He makes me look short and a little bit fat. <laughs> Ruben, tell me about your butchers. Well, mira, nosotros trabajamos con carne madurada, carne por venia de Galicia, Asturias, con entre 35 y 70 días de maduración. También tenemos una gama de quesos, tanto nacionales como de aquí de la zona de Andalucía. Tenemos también un poquito de aceite, de cerveza belga, tenemos también un poquito de, de vino. Tenemos un poquito de todo. Amazing, really, really great. Well, let's try a bit of your uh, cheese if I can. Sí, claro. Yeah? Amazing, thank you so much. Check this out. OK, 
Okay, so we just met Ruben, and I mean, there's so much in the commercial center to offer. We've got an interior design, beauty centers, hairdressers, uh, news agents just over here. Well, it doesn't stop, so we've got a vet here as well, of course. I mean, there's so many different types of shops in, in this commercial center. And very important, actually, for me is the health food shop. As you can see, I keep very, very healthy. So I want you to come and have a quick look in the health food shop. Pop in, please. So now we're in a really, really special shop because not only is the shop incredible, and not only are the products incredible, but we've also got one of my favorite people, Olga, here. And it's great to see you again. Olga, Olga's shop has uh, something quite unique here because what she does is she specializes in uh, sofas uh, uh, together with many different types of furniture. But her main speciality is custom-made sofas uh, made to fit and made to measure. So I think now you've got a really good idea of just how fantastic Guadalmina is and what the Guadalmina Commercial Center has to offer. And this is in the heart of Guadalmina. So whether you're on holiday or whether you live here, this is one of the best neighborhoods in town. Okay guys, so welcome to Guadalmina Alta and together today I'm with a very, very good friend of mine and one of my colleagues, Alexander. Alexander, introduce yourself. Fantastic, my name is Alexander Pegani and I'm here the local agent for the Sierra Guadalmina Alta. Nice uh, to meet you. All right, so listen, I want to tell you something really special about Guadalmina Alta's golf club and I want to bring you over to the logo, so come over here. Right, so um, my Spanish is worse than Alex's Spanish, so Alex is going to translate it. So, what does it actually say there, Alex? Well, El Real Club de Golf was named after the royal family of Spain before it was the golf club of Guadalmina, so it got renamed. But anyway, this golf club, golf club has been open 15 years and sharing its great experiences with its own players and members. Not only that, it also offers to you one of the greatest properties in the area. Well, what makes it also really special, Guadalmina Alta, is that surrounded in this incredible golf club are all the properties. So you're actually in, uh, in essence, you're inside the golf course all of these wonderful properties right. so let's go and have a look around shall we let's go let's do it Okay, so right now we're actually sitting in the golf club here again with Alex. Um, so tell me, Alex, behind us here, what's the name of that urbanization? Well, this beautiful complex is called Altos de Guadamina. Okay. This complex offers apartments from, well, ranging from ground floors to top floors to penthouses from 250 up to 500,000 euros. Okay. Bear in mind, you're right next to the golf cl club here. You've got easy access to amenities. Okay. And as you, as you can see as well, you've got the beautiful view of La Concha Mountain. It makes it kind of an ideal also, it, well, Holiday home, great investment as well. Exactly. Really easy to rent out. So give me an idea as well in this area, what you'd be looking at, uh, let's say if you were buying an old house to refurbishment, what type of prices sort of would like be looking at? Mind, right, right. Exactly. Okay, well, I mean, we've had some great experiences with clients here as well. So we've just sold one now. We sold one earlier on to a German gentleman. So that was a fantastic purchase. They go roughly between 700,000 and 1. 1.3 million euros. Okay, so that's kind of a refurbishment. But if you're looking at once it's refurbed, you're looking at prices anywhere from, well, we had uh, recently a house sell for over 2.3 million and it can go all the way up to 3 million depending on what you put together. Absolutely. So there's a lot of, uh, I feel kind of as Guadalmina as an area is a great investment opportunity and uh, obviously a, a wonderful place to live as well. So, Absolutely. Yeah. Okay, let's go and have a look around. We're going to show you a bit more about the golf course and more about the area. Very let's good. Go. Let's go. Well, I think what you need is you need to have your own home here, right? Absolutely, I'm working on that, Justin. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's go. Woo! Okay, so we're standing once again in Guadalmina Alta and we're outside Isla del Guadalmina. So, Alex, as you speak better Spanish than me, what does that mean? La Isla del Guadalmina, it's a fantastic area. It's called the Island of Guadalmina. It's a private organization and close with security. It's formed part form of villas and townhouses. All right. No, so, let's go, go have a little look. 
certainly in the heart of Isla de Guadalmina, and uh, I think Alex is going to tell us a little bit about Isla de Guadalmina. Correct. So this is a closed uh, complex organization with security 24-7, but anyway, regardless of that, it's surrounded by beautiful golf courses of Guadalmina. This organization consists of 30 villas and 60 beautiful townhouses, which are all facing the beautiful golf course of Guadalmina from each side. Yeah, I mean, it's one of the most sought after urbanizations. If we can get a listing in here, they sell like that. So uh, yeah, great Absolutely. urbanization. I no? mean, we've had really happy customers that have purchased properties here. And here they are living. We would like to show you around and show you the community areas, such as community pools. Should we I go? think I think there's some community pools, some private pools, or there, there it's is just a one. Community pool. Okay, well let's go and have a look at the community pool then. So we're standing right, right in the heart of Lesla de Guadalmina, and this is uh, part of what makes this so special. Um, you have a look, you feel like you're in some sort of oasis. Again, we're surrounded by golf courses. We've got townhouses all around us and detached villas. Again, one of the most, I think, one of the most beautiful areas in Guadalmina. I mean, Justin, of course, this is a beautiful area. It's located in the heart of Guadalmina Alta. You are close to all the restaurants. You have a quiet area. Again, enclosed urbanization here. Beautiful villas, beautiful townhouses. And like we said, I mean, look at this beautiful oasis pool. Absolutely. Okay, guys, so we're standing right in the center of another beautiful urbanization here in Guadalmina Alta. So, Alex. Up to you, tell me La about Riviera this one. La Riviera de Guadalmina, fantastic, nice. beautiful urbanization as well, enclosed, so it's a private gated urbanization with more than 100, roughly 120 units, including townhouses, penthouses, ground floors and middle floors. So the great thing about this area is that you're just close by to the golf course of Guadalmina, also, of course, the uh, country club of Guadalmina, El Real Club de Golf de Guadalmina. Prices? Uh, prices range between 350 up to 450,000 euros, depending Amazing. on townhouse or Fantastic. apartment. So again, a great investment opportunity or, or for is. somewhere for a holiday home. Yes. Lovely. I really love the way it's kind of laid out in this modern kind of um, Contemporary mix. Contemporary style, yeah. yes, it's yeah. fantastic. Once again, we're in Guadalmina Alta, but this time we're 10 minutes away from the beach and only five minutes away from the commercial center. And we're at Terrazas de Guadalmina. Alex, tell me all about it. Of course. This urbanization is, uh, consists of about 55 apartments, all ranging from uh, price ranges, ground floors from 250,000 up to 10,000 of 500,000 euros. It has a lovely community and a community pool area, That's right nice. close to the golf course, so it's a frontline golf course organization. Should we go and have a look at it? Let's do it. Let's go. Here we are right outside the Villas and Golf Urbanization, which is only 10 minutes away from the beach and five minutes away from the Guadalmina Commercial Center. So Alex, tell me a little bit about this wonderful urbanization. Oh, of course. This urbanization has lovely villas, which have also beautiful communal areas, such as a fantastic pool and a children's playground area. So it's obviously orientated for families. I mean, yeah, it's a family orientated area in the heart of Guadalmina well, Alta, close to amenities. Okay, and prices starting from? Here we're looking at uh, 15 villas and 85 townhouses, okay. all ranging from townhouses up from 500,000 upwards from there. Okay, fantastic. Um, great urbanization, close Absolutely. to everything. Well, I'll tell you what, it's been a long day. And uh, bringing you around Guadalmina has been quite exciting for me too. There's been bicycles, there's been golf cars, and there's been commercial centers and all the beautiful people who work there. I think we can all agree Guadalmina is a superb place to live, a superb place to come on holidays. And what I'm gonna do for the very end is I'm gonna take you to one of my favorite places. And in fact, I used to come here when I was a child. That's how well known this place is. So welcome to Guadalmina Alta Cable Ski. Let's go. Well, if I'm to be honest with you, I haven't done this for quite some time. So here we go, especially for you. 
But what I want from you is I want you to hit subscribe down there so you can see the latest properties that are coming up in Guadalmina. Check out this wonderful lake. Are you ready? Here we go.